Hello guys, in this video I'm going to install the uh, Dream UX MDK ROM 3.6 for the Samsung Galaxy J7 2015. So, without wasting more time, let's start. <laughs> First of all, reboot your phone into recovery mode. Swipe to allow modifications. It's a radio C brightness. Okay. Now we'll just back up and select everything. Don't miss the EFS, select storage as you as a micro SD card or USB OTG and swipe to backup. And then just go to wipe and wipe everything except the SD card. Just go back and go to install and in your SD card directory get this MDK ROM and just swipe to confirm flash. Let's press the next button. Backup EFS. Okay, no safe format. So uh, it's taking some time and yeah you can see for J715 and developer is Lackmail. So yeah, thanks for developing this awesome ROM. I tested this and it's a whole new style and it's better UI than the Enigma version 3. I'm not saying Enigma is uh, bad but Enigma version 3 has some uh, less icons than this. That's covered well. Okay. Boot image patcher means the installation is going to finish. And yeah, it's done like. Yeah, and uh, I'm also giving a review of the Speed Fusion Remix ROM for the Galaxy G7 so stay tuned for that next video will be on that only let's go next and reboot device ok no need ok this is the MDK boot logo made by Lacamel wait for the boot animation to come up ok this is the boot animation and we'll directly meet in the home screen and review the ROM and also skip the setup wizard. The ROM is booted up and here you can see the uh, it's SH style remix. I will change the wallpaper because it's too dark and it looks so dull but it, uh, wallpapers are good layer. I will take this one which comes with the S7. Okay, this is good bright. Okay, let's uh, handle the brightness here too low so this is the home screen and our device looks like the s7 plus s8 and here we get a wechat extra we can uninstall it yes great and everything works fine let's go to settings it's the nougat style everything is nougat style here you can see mdk rom is the 3.6 version and the kernel is stock one and it's yeah dream ux no user support so those who are using uh, two home screens so no user support here settings are same everything is same no major changes all apps are nougat themed browser is the new one which comes with the samsung thing uh, uh, nougat ones and the newest music too good that's very great 
the voice record is also new yeah, with plenty of new apps and let's see the RAM the first boot we get what RAM we get here and here we go to RAM and when we clean everything let's see I guess like 570 or 580 MB whoa 596 so this is great the RAM performance is very well let's see what type of storage we get okay sorry I should have entered there only and here is device maintenance and storage okay 10.2 gigs so it's lesser than the uh, note 7 and enigma uh, not note 7 enigma version 3 and a5 2017 and nemesis 2 they got to 4 10 point uh, like uh, nearly 10.5 gigs so this was the uh, review was this rom let's look about the camera now camera is good no more things like here uh, okay all filters appeared here you can see uh, the camera filters and okay everything works I clicked photos and everything they are working so uh, this was the uh, small review for this ROM I hope you liked it and if you liked it please press the like button and comment for any issues and yeah apps is also good working multi window is also there so it's quick and fast multi windows are also there support so you can select this so yeah if you like this video please press the like button comment for any issues regarding this video or any help for feedback and then please subscribe me for more videos out there so yeah goodbye guys and have a nice day or if you have a good night so bye bye